what exactly is God's view on drinking alcoholic wine? What is your own view on drinking alcoholic wine? Come with me. Let me give you my own view on alcoholic wine based on Bible examples. Keep watching. Hello everyone, my name is Avalake Janet Oyelami. Today I'm going to talk about what is God's view on drinking alcoholic wine. But before I move forward in talking more about today's topic, let me give the keyword that summarizes today's topic. Today's topic says, I actually love and focus more on Jesus' word and God's spoken words in the Bible. Jesus went to a marriage ceremony. He turned water to wine. Immediately, everyone started to drink the wine. It was not covered up to ferment for five days before they started drinking it. For those who argued Jesus turned water to alcoholic wine, answer the question here. Is Jesus wine alcoholic or non-alcoholic wine? If alcoholic wine is created when non-alcoholic wine get fermented, so how is Jesus wine alcoholic? Answer the question yourself. Then, if you agree with me that non-alcoholic wine is good, then we are in the same healthy lifestyle vehicle. Dear friends, maybe you don't know that once you give your life to Christ, you have become a peculiar person. What exactly is the difference between alcoholic wine and non-alcoholic wine? First of all, let me ask you and make sure you answer the question wherever you are now. How is mind made? I mean alcoholic wine. Let me give you my research result. Just about any type of fruit can be fermented to produce alcohol. Fermentation is a process in which sugar is converted to alcohol by yeast. Many people have argued that Jesus turned wine to alcoholic wine. But when I did my research, I got to know that definitely Jesus wine is not alcoholic because wine is produced when a fruit is left or covered up for a few days to get fermented. But when Jesus turned water to wine, he told the people to take the wine to the wedding organizer immediately. Answer the question now. Is that alcoholic wine or non-alcoholic wine? Let's continue. Now, let me now give God's view about alcoholic wine. God chose Samson. Before the parent got pregnant, God sent an angel to the parent and gave a description of who the child would be and what kind of food the child should eat, what kind of drink the child should drink. God told the parent, do not cut the hair of Samson and do not give him alcoholic wine or strong drink. Why did God say that to Samson's parent? Because Samson is the chosen one for a special assignment to deliver God's children from Philistine hand. God knows what fermented wine does to human body. That is why if you are chosen by God for a special assignment and you really know the peculiar person, even if God does not send angels to tell you don't drink alcoholic wine, because you are a peculiar person chosen by God, remember what God told Samson and apply it to your life. God knows that if his chosen one drinks wine, it takes their eye off him because even if you drink small wine, lot of wine, it does have a negative effect on the body. I will show you an example. If you read Numbers chapter 6 verse 3 to 7, you will see what wine, I mean alcoholic wine, does to the body there. If you look at Noah's life, after he came out from the ark, he drank wine and he was left naked 
in his room. If you look at the children of Lot, the two girls, they knew what wine can do to the body. The daughter of Lot gave their father alcoholic wine. It's definitely alcoholic because immediately Lot drank it. He fell asleep. He doesn't even know when his daughters came to sleep with him and got pregnant through him. If you look at John the Baptist, Aaron's family, the priest family, even Jesus Christ, God gave description on how they should live their life. Especially, he said to John the Baptist's parents, Do not give him strong drink and do not give him alcoholic wine. Likewise, he commanded Aaron's family, None of the priests should drink alcoholic wine. None of the priests should drink strong drink. The reason why I think God said this is based on the negative effect of wine on the body. Wine are the negative effects on Noah's life. Looking at this scenario of negative effect of wine on people's body, I hope you will agree with me today. God gave this commandment for you as a peculiar person, for me as a peculiar person who have given our life to Christ, not to drink alcoholic wine just because it will have negative effect on our physical body and our spiritual body. If you look at Lot, Lot did not even hear the voice of God after drinking wine. Noah could not hear the voice of God when he has drank a lot of wine and became naked. God also knows that since you are a chosen generation, a peculiar person, you have an assignment you need to do in this world before the rapture takes place. And if you continue to drink wine, it affects you spiritually, physically, and it slows you down to achieve what God has sent you to do in life. I'm not going to force you to stop drinking it, but have a routine today that you have not come into this world for yourself. You are a peculiar person, sent by God for an assignment. Don't say Samson, John the Baptist, Jesus Christ were the only people sent by God to have a particular assignment in the world. The moment you give your life to Christ, you are a chosen generation, a peculiar person. You have an assignment here to do. What does alcoholic wine do to the body? It mocks those who drink it. It mocks those who drink it. It disgraces them like it disgraced Noah. It causes sorrow, wound without cause to the person who drinks the wine. It poisons like a viper. So my own conclusion about drinking alcoholic wine based on all what I've shared earlier says that alcoholic wine is not biblical alcoholic wine is not the will of God for you so this is my own opinion based on Bible research but what is your own opinion leave a comment below in conclusion I will say to you today, my dear friend, that you are a chosen generation, a peculiar person, like Jesus, like John the Baptist, like Samson. It doesn't mean your life will be ended like the way Samson's life was ended. You are different. This is the era of Jesus Christ. I will advise you to have a rethink on drinking alcoholic wine because you are sent to this world for an assignment and the people that you have been sent to for that assignment are waiting for you to start working on that assignment so that you can impact their life also alcoholic wine will delay you from running after the god's given assignment i hope this impacts you i hope this encourage you to run after your dream speak to you soon God bless.